and welcome back to another fabulous video on my channel. I'm Jacob, and Jacob is here, and today we are playing Birth to Death. Birth to Death is where we follow a single sim from Birth to Death. This is season one, season two. We'll pick up right after the ending of this for Growing Together, which is the brand new expansion pack in The Sims 4. I could not think of a more perfect sim to experience Growing Together with than Mindy. You know what? That's what we're doing. So Mindy, like I said, is here. This is her bachelor party. She is getting married. It's super duper exciting. I've never done a bachelor party before, and so uh, we'll see how this goes. I'm using my wedding story to throw said bachelor party. It's called batch party or something of those lines because it can be a bachelorette, bachelor. It can just be a batch, you know what I mean? We're here. Mindy brought all of her closest girlfriends and her one guy friend who would definitely be here for this party. You know, Jaden. He's over here somewhere. There he is. There's a good old boy. And so we're gonna come over here and dance. So we invited Morgan, who we don't know who Morgan is. And then we also invited Kendra, who is our actual maid of honor. Evie, who is the troublemaker. Jay, Jaden, who is like our really, really good friend who probably should be our maid of honor. I thought about it afterwards and it totally made more sense than Kendra, but like we're doing what we gotta do. And then we also invited Amira, which is our soon to be husband's ex fiance who technically is one of our very close friends from high school. It's complicated. We dated the high, the person in high school. Group dance, the one, two, steppy, stepping. Oh, we also know her. She was in college. She was a contender to date at one point. She's a fan of me. I wouldn't say it's, it's me that we're a fan of. They actually could possibly be a fan of Evie. I would say that's very possible. Oh, my. Oh, okay. Okay, Mindy. I originally had was going to plan strippers to come to the bachelor party, and it just didn't end up working out. Oh my gosh. Eve's doing a phenomenal job, if I say so myself. I think I probably end up having to, and then we can do like a group dance. You know, I said I didn't want it, but I also kind of love it. There's just so many good poses. Like, it's kind of insane. All right, I want to try the other one. You off. You off. Genuinely curious. Oh, that one. Okay, okay. He's looking great. Maybe you lost movement, but that's okay. Oh, that was a good one. And then I think we might do a dance battle against, like a fun, like little dance battle type of thing. Oh my. Are we actually gonna do it? This is something I've not done in years either, which I think could be kind of fun. Our dance skill isn't exactly like the highest in the world. We're like a level four. I think it might be a five level skill too. So actually, it's pretty good. I actually don't know if we're dancing or we're not. She has some fans. That's crazy to me. We do have a wedding in the morning, so I probably shouldn't be out super late. Okay, and then lastly, we we might, okay, so we did the whole dancing aspect of the night. So we might try to bring the party inside. I really don't know how, how well that worked, but I am going to try. I might order my favorite drink. Now, technically, Mindy has been through recovery for, because she was, she wasn't, I'd say she is addicted. She was addicted to alcohol at one point in time. It was a very secretive thing that she kept to herself. I don't think Evie even knew that it was a problem that she dealt with. And it wasn't until Evie left her and she was, you know, gone. It was about a year or so, six months, that she started to, like, really, like, do some stuff and to really figure herself out. And so whatever drink she might end up getting would be a virgin drink anyways. I don't want you guys to worry that she's having, like juice she's not she this is this would be without juice you know so she did work on it and she hopefully recovered really nicely also guys another thing i can update you guys on is that she has decided that she wants to become friends with dina i felt like that was such yeah like it's a version like such a big improvement on mindy as a person like it was really insane to me a little bit because mindy has always been like one of those people who has like held the vendetta against Dina. We've been here, we've known this for the entire time. And so at the engagement dinner, she was like, I kind of want to become friends with her. I want to switch that relationship around. And it might be the fact that she's had to see her mom once a week, every week for the past, like, well, it's been quite a while, as we know. A year. It's been a year. Oh my god, that's crazy. That she's having, she's been having to do this because of her business that she owns that we've not been to in a while. But then again, we have wedding stuff going on and they're doing fine with money because she's getting paid. She's, she works many side end jobs and stuff ultimately i just thought it was like a, such a cool and big moment for for mindy mindy is just she's just genuinely she's just having the best time of her life she's finally found her happiness which i think is just so cool and it, it's just a good moment for for everybody or for for mindy specifically because like she worked so hard to get here to get to this moment in time 
you know, Mindy's had a very hard life. She's she struggled so much, like so so much. It hurts. It it genuinely hurts a lot normally because of how much she has struggled in the past. I'm excited to see to see her happy, just to see her get married and, and just enjoy life. She really wants a kid. We talked about this before. She wanted someone that she would go on dates with that loved her and she got that. She wanted someone to, she wanted a business. She's going to get that. And she so badly wants a kid. She thinks about having a kid every episode, if not more. And it's just something that she, she does like just desperately wants. Oh, everybody's leaving. Okay. Well, that means special party is over. Oh, yeah, it's work in the morning. That's fine. I hope you guys enjoyed this very much shorter episode. I have a feeling this is going to be like three or four minutes long, maybe five minutes long. But that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please give me a thumbs up. And the Growing Together is already here. But I'm excited. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. And I'll see you guys all for the wedding. Oh my god.